Raceway. Moments ago, the caution coming out when Kyle Petty tags the left rear of Tommy Houston. Houston's car is Buick spinning, and he will slam the wall in turns one and two. Really coming into hard contact. Houston high in the point standings, and he was not a happy camper, Ned. No, he wasn't. During a caution, he caught up to Kyle Petty going into turn three, and you can see he gives him a little bit of a nudge there. They make it three deep. However, they are under caution, but Tommy Houston was not happy about the left side. He's got the nose in on the inside right there. He thinks he's got him cleared. The, the zero car, Tommy Houston. Houston comes down the line. Looks like Tommy coming down. It's hard to say, but they got together right there. Luckily enough, no one else got in. Getting loose right now. You see the back end starting around on the car. As he comes around, everybody behind him is just a victim. Except Benson, who was close enough to get through. And you see Sawyer get into Labonte, turn yep. Labonte. Up and over goes LaJoy. Riser hits the outside wall. So does Pearson. Riser spins full around, and Labonte goes straight back into the outside wall. Boy. Look at Riser's car slide after caroming off the infield pit wall. And six cars going into the corner that way. Oh, oh, and in trouble is Houston for the wall. That'll bring out a caution. Chuck Bound getting collected with 63 and spinning. Harry Gant spun down. There's Lasser going. Get this replay first. Tommy Houston. Oh, Tommy. Tommy Houston got down to the bottom. Boy, everybody's slipping and sliding everywhere. The 99 car, Ricky Craven, did quite a job with the white car sneaking through there. And not sneaking through his contact right here. Oops. 22, Jeff Berry. Row one. When on lap four, Tommy Houston lost control, collecting Ward Burton, Jim Bound, and Chad Chapin. Oh, oh yeah, the 72. There you go. Looks like Tommy Houston and Dylan might have gotten together right there. Yeah, and there come Grissom and there's Glenn Allen, the 99, just got caught up. Yeah. That replay Boy, look at <laughs> That's the 38 oh, car, I believe. He Dennis just squeezed it. Here's your leader. The track, if he could. Let's see. Let's watch it as he goes into the turn. There's Houston on the outside. You can see the car getting loose. Apparently a tire went down or something. And there's Bobby Labonte. There must have been grease or oil or something on that track because Labonte had got up a little high as well. And pole center. As the green flag being waved, the Budweiser 250. Oh, trouble here right on the front start. Front straightaway on the start of the race, Tommy Houston. Right, watch the black and orange car. There is contact. And then he not, gets a little I'm side not side. sure there was contact. It may be, but it looked like Brad just got loose, and that maybe the air got off of his spoiler, but he goes right back in front. Watch it go up the track, entirely block the racetrack, and... Uh, where can you go? I mean, everybody's going close to 200 miles, 195 miles an hour or so, and there's just nowhere to go. Pick your favorite. There's a lot of them in there in this 13-car wreck. Darrell Waltrip, after he got clipped, he got together with Kenny Schrader. In this mess, Tommy Ellis, Kyle Petty, Rick Mast, Michael Waltrip, Jack Ingram. Many of the top stars of this race. Jeff Purvis in there, Chuck Bound, Frank Fleming, who is making his first start in this race. Dave Rezendi is in there as well. You have traffic out there beforehand. Let's look, look at here. what happened here. Coming oh, through he, turn four. Yeah, he got a little bump. <laughs> the 51 car got a bump from uh, that, uh, who that red and white car there is. Might I be Jeremy tell. Mayfield, perhaps. But he got a little little tap there. Boy, here they come, too. Whoa, he's a setting duck. And you believe that he uh, got hit right at the end. A lot of contact. They're looking at Mike Wallace right now. Safety crew on the scene. Tell you what happened. Look how straight he's going, Mike. I saw him when he entered the third turn. The car never slowed down, and he actually cut that corner cross. And I mean, he went straight. Watch the car right now. The right front's gone, and he's headed right down at that inside concrete wall. And when he hit there, we saw the right front blaze up. Here. And way up in the left corner of your screen. Well, he spun all the way around. And there is Bobby Labonte, the red car. He was in it. Yep. So the three cars all spun but that Grissom and Houston took each other to the wall. At